Where am I? What is this place? Greetings, Alora. Who are you? I am Furby Fan, the defendant counsel of the wrestling and pony communities. I'm also a YouTuber. Um, I kind of wanted to pick you up here because um, I don't think this whole villain thing's gonna work out. I realized this whole time, your evil plan, it's just stupid. You know, it's kind of an issue, really. The only reason you really wanted to enslave all those ponies in Starlet Ridge is just so you can find a way to find to get your brother back. All you really want to do is just go home, and I, I, I'm starting to realize this whole villain plot of yours is kind of stupid. If you really wanted to go to go home and with your brother so bad, why didn't you just, you know, speak up about it? Because no one really would understand my pain. And besides, it's better that they not know about this. It's my personal business anyway. So that's why I enslaved all those ponies to find that special star. But knowing that Sunny and the others have had that jewel this whole time, I sent Twitch over to, you know, spy on them. But however, that ended drastically as he's now one of them, you know. It's not fair. Now I have to do all this myself. And don't even get me started. Last time me and Sonny, you know, when I died was like a couple weeks ago. <sighs> it's just not enough. I am going to find my way back. No matter what it takes. And enslave more ponies with mind control? Seriously. What you're doing is absolutely stupid. Sure, hopefully you had a vision because she was, she was mistreated, you know? But she was different, you know? She was a fire alicorn. She wanted power and dominance. You know, she's like the she's like the forgotten third sister. I don't even know if, she, if she's actually related to Celestia or Luna or like family or something. But you know, at least Opaline had a better better reason of becoming evil. What you're doing is just sad, and that's why you're stale. You're a stale character. I swear. You know, it's so cliche. I mean. You don't really have to be evil like this. I mean, who are you trying to mock here? Sunset Shimmer? Starlight Glimmer? It just doesn't seem right. You don't tell me what to do. I might as well control you with my perfect voice. No, you know, I ain't falling for that shit. Not, not this time. I got sound deafening headphones. And you're not going to control me with your voice. It's not how it works anymore. I don't want to talk to you right now about that, Opal Opaline. Oh, did I say Opaline? You look exactly like Opaline. Look at you. You're purple. You're blue. Are you mocking her? I don't even know who this Opaline is. Laura, oh, Laura, please. Listen. If you want to go home so bad, I can, you know, I can, I can transport a portal with the help of Dr. Strange to take you back home because I, I, you're just a stale ass villain. And I believe it's time for you now to face the consequences of being stale. You kind of put this generation into a downfall in the first place, along with some of the haters. So, um, you wait here. I'm going to go get you, get some friends and we're going to have a talk about this. Whatever you say. You child. I'm 18, by the way. And just so you know, I don't like you, and I never will. I, I never really liked you in the first place. I was going to give you a chance. Now I just feel like you're a rejected Jacqueline from Avalor. How dare you? Seriously, though. And seriously, how do Jacqueline's get hair? I feel like you just, I feel like it's a wig. No, it's a wig. It's actually my hair. It accompanies my fur. And speaking of, you're, I know you're a jackal or a snow leopard or whatever, but I didn't even I didn't even realize this till like a couple months back, but you have a cutie mark. How is that possible? I I don't know. I'm gonna get the others. You stay here. Fine. Alright, Opaline. Damn it, I said Oakley again, didn't I? It's Alora. I apologize. You know what? I feel like you are mocking Oakley. Your names are similar. Your color scheme is similar. I mean, I, I think they're 
Chris, you know, with the fact that it is, they're just trying to cover up the fact that Oakley is dead, and so we're replacing it with a new, new villain covered in purple schemes that wants to control magic. It's actually kind of a stupid excuse. Let's just accept the fact that Oakley was a better villain than you. Yeah, shut up. All right, girls. All right, calm down, everyone. What do you want, Sunny? Listen, I know your pain, and it's kind of it's it's kind of stupid to realize that the whole reason you enslaved those those ponies in their frozen empire is because just so you, just so you can find a way back to your brother. I mean, you could have at least just told us that you had these that, that you had issues of coming back home. How were you even vanished anyway? Was like is that like even mentioned? You know what? I'm, I'm going to stop talking about that right now. It's just that, uh, this is a little embarrassing talking to you, but I feel like your villainous schemes are a bit stale. You know, when Opaline was around taking over the world, at least she had some se had some common sense. I mean, you should have been there for the war games. It was intense. I mean, she had all these guards and everything. So, um, I just think you're a stale villain, Alora. but you can change. So I'm asking you um, for redemption. I don't know. Will you? I don't know what to say here. It's kind of stupid because I know it is kind of true, but um, you can be with us. We're like way better. And besides, you don't have to control everyone to get what you want. It's kind of like being spoiled. We can take you back to your brother. But you're gonna to have to tell us why you were banished in the first place. It was a long time ago. I was a child. We were children. But we still communicate through our hearts. I can hear his voice commanding everything we say. I just want to get back to him as soon as possible so I can live my life again and get away from all of you. But sometimes life is just not fair like that, isn't it? No, it's not. But for Refan as a point, I know your villainous reign was terrible, but I think it's about time to think about redemption. I just feel like you're just a ripoff of Opaline at this point. And people are even concerned that you're actually Opaline. Not whoever Opaline is. She's an evil fire alicorn that was banished from Skyros, the Alicorn Kingdom, which I didn't know existed until, you know, when Spike told the story and everything, but still. I didn't even know there were more alicorns. That explains Lauren Faust. Is she canon? But anyways, enough with that. I really w I just want to explain to this right now, you know? <sighs> this is a lot to take in, but... Okay. Let's just cut to the chase. Let's cut this short. Your villainous reign sucked. It's time for you. It's time to think about redemption. And uh, we'll promise to give you, you know, everything you receive just so you can shut up. Uh, you can, you can really do that, of course. And besides, Furry Fan has better things to do right now. And the fact that you know our generation is coming to an end, we don't know where our, where our future lies. So I'm the creator of this video, may have to, you know, figure that out if Hasbro's not going to do so. This whole G6 thing is stupid, you know? I just don't see myself, you know? The whole reason we were telling the story in the first place is because we were trying to follow in Twilight's footsteps after she was deceased. But now the fact that Twilight's gonna be alive in G6, it just doesn't make any sense. It's just too many plot holes, like modern SML. Good thing I don't watch that, so, um, but anyways. So are you up to the task of redeeming yourself? You know what? I guess I really don't have another choice, do I? I mean, you did it with Twitch, so I guess I'm gonna do the same with you. Yeah, and you know what? It's actually pretty sad. I was expecting to, you know, to do this with you in like the seventh chapter of Make Your Mark. But now that we know that this series is canceled on Netflix and um, probably due to politics and um, animation restrictions and um, hatred across other people. So it's kind of sad that we were doing this, you know, in a fan video other than being in a realistic fashion, because we all know Tell Your Tale is actually crappy cheesy 2D animation, and we're competing with Wild Mings by Jack Specific, so... <sighs> Let's just let bygones be bygones and shut up about it. Deal.
You know, now I think about it, I think my evil plan and evil schemes I did like a couple of moons back was kind of stupid. Yeah, you owe, you owe everyone in Starlight Ridge an apology. Yeah, you enslaved everybody. It's not fair. Then again, you're going to have to apologize to everyone. I will, okay? Just take me back to my brother. Okay, Dr. Strange, you set up the portal? Yep, you're on it. I'm on it, man. All right, this will take you directly back to where your brother is so we can shut up all about it. Thank you, Dr. Strange. You're welcome. Now, um, let's send this here. Yeah, and then afterwards we can meet up with each other and we can apologize to everyone. Deal. I swear, Alora was such a stale villain in the franchise. Yeah, Oakley was like so much better. She had potential. You know, Oakley was great. I just don't see, you know, a lot of attention for Alora, you know. She seems kind of, you know, they're, they're literally trying to knock off Oakley right, right off our shoes for some reason. I mean, she literally belongs to go back to Avalor for all, for all time's sake. That's where most of the Jackwins are. Well, actually, they're, they're in a specific magical realm that I forgot the name of because I haven't watched the show in a while. But anyways, yeah. So I'm glad all that done is over. Good. And uh, Sunny, I'm sorry that your series is coming to an end and G6 is going to be, a, you know, a downfall and a train wreck. It's okay for everything. I, I understand. But, um, so yeah, I guess we're moving on now. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to go back to talking about wrestling for a moment. Good. And uh, don't forget, guys, an MLP WWE special is coming November 27th, so stick around. Maybe not the 27th, maybe the 23rd. It's going to take a lot of editing skills and stuff, so um, I also have to be careful not to be blocked by the entire pay-per-view itself. So, um, yeah. But anyways, yeah, this was, an, this was a complete explanation why Alora is a scale villain in the form of a skit. So, yeah. Um, Opalini's better by 100 million percent. Too bad we're never going to see her again. So, yeah. Uh, yeah, this is us signing off. And take care and hooks to hearts and Netflix half for this is all your fault. You ruined my little pony, the Generation 5. So, um, yeah. It's kind of sad, actually. We're, we, this series was, like, ruined. The franchise is, like, ruined. It's the shortest generation on, like, G3.